Question number 1. Which state of matter has a definite shape and volume? The correct answer is letter B, solid. Question number 2. Which of the following is not a mixture? The correct answer is letter B, water. Question number 3. A student mixes iron filings and sulfur powder, then heats the mixture. A new substance forms that is no longer magnetic. What type of change has occurred? The correct answer is letter B, chemical change. Question number 4. Which of the following is a physical change? The correct answer is letter A, melting ice. Question number 5. Which of these is true about the particles in a gas compared to a solid? The correct answer is letter D, particles in a gas move freely and spread out to fill a container. Dot. Question number 6. A student mixes vinegar and baking soda, which creates bubbles and a fizzing sound. What does this indicate? The correct answer is letter C, a chemical change, because a gas is produced. Question number 7. What happens to molecules when a substance changes from a liquid to a gas? The correct answer is letter D, they move farther apart and faster. Question number 8. Which property of matter describes how much space it takes up? The correct answer is letter D, volume. Question number 9. Which of the following would best describe a chemical change? The correct answer is letter D, a log burning to produce ash and smoke. Question number 10. In a closed container, water is heated until it turns into steam. Which of these statements is correct? The correct answer is letter D, the water molecules spread out as they become gas. Question number 11. Which statement is true about mixtures? The correct answer is letter C, components of a mixture can be separated by physical means. Question number 12. Which of these best describes what happens when you mix oil and water?
The correct answer is letter D, they form a mixture but stay separate because they don't mix well. Question number 13. Which process is an example of condensation? The correct answer is letter D, water vapor cooling and forming droplets on a cold surface. Question number 14. What happens to molecules when a substance changes from a liquid to a gas? The answer is letter D, they move farther apart and faster. Question number 15. Anna has a metal spoon and a plastic spoon. She stirs a pot of hot soup with each spoon. She notices the metal spoon becomes hot, but the plastic spoon does not. Why might this be happening? The correct answer is letter D, metal conducts heat better than plastic, so the heat travels up the spoon. Question number 16. Jamie is baking cookies. She notices that the dough changes color and becomes firm after baking. Which of the following best explains what happens to the dough in the oven? The correct answer is letter D, a chemical change happens because the dough changes color and texture. Question number 17. Mia has a mixture of salt and sand. She wants to separate them. Which of the following methods would be most effective for separating the salt and sand? The correct answer is letter D, dissolve the salt in water, filter out the sand, and then evaporate the water. Question number 18. Which separation method would you use to separate sand from water? The correct answer is letter A, filtration. Question number 19. Which of the following is an example of a heterogeneous mixture? The correct answer is letter B, vegetable soup. Question number 20. Which property best describes a heterogeneous mixture? The correct answer is letter D. It consists of visibly different substances or phases.